Excuse me. Um, can I ask you a question? I'm, I'm new here. My name is Blaine. Kurt. Let's talk about for the, the first episode, you're singing uh, Teenage Dream. Yeah. Which was such, I love that, that was so beautiful, that whole episode, everything about it. And, uh, and then it went to number one on iTunes, right? That's, yeah. I told Ryan Murphy that was just such a great show. People are going nuts over the Wayne and, and Kurt fiasco that's going on. Like, they, they are nuts. Like, I've never seen anything like it before. It's been an incredible thing because it's, it's been an incredibly uh, positive response, both from the gay and straight community. They're very intense about it. Like, they, they want this to happen, and they want it to happen now. I'm a huge claim fan. I'm a huge claim. Uh -huh. You know, I'm just big on, the, on, that, on that pair. And then you're on the cover of yeah, Entertainment yeah. Weekly. <laughs> And uh, first of all, are you, are you taking all this in? This is pretty amazing. It's, it's been a roller coaster. I think there's definitely a lot of pressure almost playing a, um, a gay teen on, on television. And I'm the one who always gets the, the very heart-wrenching emails and, and Facebook messages from, from the fans that are watching the show. There is a mother, she blogs about her seven-year-old son and how her seven-year-old son basically came out and told her, Hey, Mommy, I'm gay. Now, she says that her son has always had a crush on Glee's uh, Blaine. And I think everyone is just so happy that there's finally a, a positive portrayal of, of a character um, like Kurt on TV. And the Golden Globe goes to Chris Colfer. <laughs> Most importantly, to all the amazing kids that watch our show and the kids that our show celebrates who are constantly told no by the people in their environments, by bullies at school, that they can't be who they are or have what they want because of who they are. Well, screw that, kids. Some days more so than others, I think that Kurt and Blaine will be together. It seems like it would be more foolish not to have them be together, but it's a process. I mean, they can't just, you know, suddenly come together. I mean, we're we're the fun enough. You move me, Kurt. And Stuart would just be an excuse to spend more time with you. What these television programs are doing is glamorizing homosexual behavior, glamorizing homosexual conduct. It's just not a lifestyle. It's not behavior that ought to be glamorized or presented in a way that makes it uh, idealistic. This is the second decade of the 21st century. I don't really understand why this conversation is even being held. Do you really think that this is the kind of thing that's contagious? That I don't kids know. kids see this, that they're going to say, gee, I, I want to be a girl, and I'm not going to wear my well, outside. Prejudice is just ignorance. It's time people start being honest about their sexuality and the society, because we're here, we're queer, you may as well get used to it. I promise it gets so much better. You have a Yeah, it's encouraging. It's not great that there is the interest in it is a positive choice. You know, that's a wonderful position to be in. Do you think now is the time to be a good choice? Wow, we're still there. Okay. Okay. Being able to finally do this thing that has needed to happen forever, it was like a relief too. There's never been Anything that I can recall about my generation like that. Um, and uh, I was really honestly scared about it until I saw it. And I saw that it's really very good story and very, very painful. So. Yeah. The people have sent me letters where they've been really moved and kind of reevaluated the way they thought about things. You are the love of my life, Kurt. You're gonna be alright. I told you. I'll never say goodbye to you.
So here's what you missed on Glee. It's a very intense moment. Yeah, for sure. That uh, where we went places. To say the least. And that's what you missed on Glee. Hey! You're not alone, together we stand I'll be by your side, you know I'll take your hand But when it gets cold, and it feels like the end There's no place to go, you know I won't give up No, I won't give up Yeah.